will be using the Kat Von D Mi Vida Loca palette today. And let's get started. This is the eye look. First, I'll be using a Morphe M511 with the shade Noble. We're just gonna buff this lightly in the upper crease area. And just keep it like really circular, like a half circle. And next, I'm going in with a MAC 217 brush with the shade Analog. And we're gonna take that into the crease area. Tell me what you guys are doing for Thanksgiving in the comments below. I want to hear about it. What we do is we go to my aunt and uncle's house and we have our dinner. Well, it's, we actually have like a lunch. And now I'm just going to take my M511 brush with more of the shade Noble. And see, because I have like a really bad patch of color there, we'll just softly blend that out. And I'm just going to take more of that and then put it on the lid here, on the outer and inner corners. Next, I'm taking this Zoeva 231 brush and I'm taking the color Rewind. And we're going to put this in the outer and inner corners. You just take my MAC 217 again. And now I'm going to take a pencil brush and I'm going to pick up the color Vox and I'm going to place that in the very outer corner and the very inner corner here. And then we're going to take more of the Rewind shade to help blend that out. And then picking up my MAC 217 again with more of Analog. And we're going to buff out these edges here. For the lid, I took some concealer on the back of my hand with this Real Techniques Detailer Brush. So basically what I did is you go into the crease, kind of cut it out a bit. Pull it down here. All right, so now I'm blending this out with my finger. It is a Bare Minerals shadow. The color is um, Overjoyed. I'm using my MAC 239 brush and I'm going to start kind of pressing it on because it is a loose pigment so it can go all over the place. My friend Kate actually gave this to me. So, hi Kate, thank you for the shadow. You can wet your brush with um, some Fix Plus, but I didn't. It's up to you. You can get more of a metallic effect. I'm going to pick up Harpist Cord. And I'm going over just the two areas on the sides to help the colors blend together. I always end up with concealer on my pants. Anyway, whatever concealer I have on the back of my hand still, I'm just going to apply that to my under eyes. I would have had a little bit more, but it ended up on my pants, so I'll have to apply more later. First, I'm gonna tight line my upper waterline. Then I'm going to line my lower waterline with like wine colored pencil. I'm going to take my Zoeva 231 again with the rewind shade. And we're applying that to, again, the inner and outer corners, but this time on the lower lash line. And then 
connecting them here on the outer corner here. And then picking up my MAC 217 with the color Analog. And we're going to take this all around the eye here. So now I'm taking more of the Overjoyed Shadow. And I'm applying that to the center of my lower lash line. Lyric. Puffing that in. Now for my brow bone, I'm taking molder. Don't want this to be shimmery since I have the shimmer on the lid. I'm going to curl my lashes first and apply mascara. These are House of Lashes Boudoir Lashes. All right, now I'm gonna pop on my lash here. and apply some mascara on my lower lashes. And this is the finished look.